Now many of you already know that the ET9 it is the top tier when it comes to all the new models that they sell and that car was the center of attraction even at the Shanghai Auto Show which just came to an end last week. And some of the standout features into that car is of course the stair by wire, is the active suspension and the technology as a whole. You know that that is the first car to use new in-house developed autonomous driving chip. That is the first car to to be using NEO's operating system SkyOS. So there is a lot that it's happening around that car over and above the beauty and the technologies that you see in that car. But on today's video, I want to talk to you about stay by wire. Now, you will notice there that there is a video of Mercedes highlighting about or talking about their car starting to use stay by wire. And when I saw this, I was very excited because whilst other car makers are planning on starting with the step-by-wire or introducing a step-by-wire technology, which obviously Neo partnered with ZF Group to be able to get that technology in their 89, to see Mercedes following what Neo has already achieved and they are already selling cars with that technology, it is something that is just so great. I mean, step by wire, we have seen so many videos uh, uh, showing us how it makes it easier for you to handle or to control the car. Instead of turning the steering wheel quite number of time, a lot of times to make the car turn, step by wire, it, it does not really require you to tilt the, the, the steering wheel that much for the car to turn. You'll remember that it's not only the front tires that are turning, but I think the uh, rear tires are also turning at an angle of 16 degrees, which is something that is very, very exciting. And seeing Mercedes uh, introducing or discussing the fact that they will be launching this, it is something that is just so great, something that is very amazing. And it shows us or tells us not only where Neo is at, but where they can be. To see, to see Mercedes implementing this kind of technology, I must say, this is good news, man, to Neo because Neo has, has successfully deployed this technology. Even the ZF Group CEO, Dr. Olga Klein, confirmed that NEO it is the first car to, to successfully deploy this technology onto the cars that are on the roads, on the streets, which is something that is very, very good. So seeing Mercedes coming to follow suit what NEO has already achieved, it speaks volumes about the kind of a car company NEO is. It speaks volume about where NEO is currently at and where it could be in the future. One thing that we know about the Neo CEO, after the Chinese New Year holiday, he mentioned a very strong, powerful statement, and he said, Neo intends to be at the top when it comes to technology in this fast-growing EV space. And I think, and without even a single doubt, you and me can agree that there is no car maker out there that is as good like Neo when it comes to technology. What that is as good when it comes to some of the features that you find on the a neo cars like the ET9. I mean, this is the reason why even McLaren has it wants to has partnered with Neo, and the partnership will entail Neo uh, giving or making some of the technology to McLaren. This speaks volumes about the kind of a company Neo is. This speaks volume about the kind of a company Neo will be in the future, and it is for this reason that I continue increasing my holdings, loading the boat because the very same. A technology like a step by wire that Mercedes intends on launching and the Neo has already launched. I'm telling you all the other luxury cars are just going to come and follow suit and make sure that they use the same technology which was first successfully achieved by Neo on a model which is something that is just so great. So this is good news. This is amazing, exciting and like I said it tells us where Neo is headed and as an investor I am happy to see this. I will not be surprised if in the next coming few months some of the or one of the new energy vehicle car makers is talking about creating and deploying their own battery swapping stations because I don't think they, they are ignoring what they are seeing on the streets when it comes to that technology. I don't think that 134,000 swaps that got completed by Neo last week or some day last week, they take that very lightly. I'm telling you almost everyone wish they had this kind of technology or they had started uh, this kind of technology with Neo back in 2018 but Neo it's already far Neo has, has already covered a, a, 
um, a, a huge ground in terms of where you can find these battery shopping stations in China, which this, my friends, it's one thing that gives Neo you know, a competitive advantage. So when it comes to technology, uh, don't be surprised when you start seeing other, especially premium EV brands, your BBAs, or uh, also following Neo when it comes to the technology, right? Yes, this step by wire, it was not created by Neo. Step by wire comes from ZF Group, and ZF Group, in co in in cooperation with Neo, they managed to successfully uh, deploy that that uh, technology onto the 89. And ZF Group CEO, by the way, uh, during the Shanghai Auto Show, you know that he also bought the Neo 89 with the step by wire, which was just so great seeing that. So I am happy, man. I am excited, and like I said, I thought I'd come and give you this quick update. Tell me what you think about this. Blue sky is coming. Long term will win. Those that are persevering throughout the headwinds, the share price will most definitely be rewarded with time. Like this video, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Tell me what you think about this. I know share price wise, Neo might not be doing the most, but knowing that Mercedes is going to obviously implement or is going to introduce a technology that Neo has already introduced, this speaks volumes about. Uh, Neo, right? Neo's technology, what Neo is doing, and very soon, if not, if these uh, BBAs or high-end premium luxury brands like Mercedes, BMW, Audi that compete or that are direct competitors to Neo, if they don't partner with Neo uh, when it comes to their battery shopping station technology, very soon, unfortunately, they are going to be left behind because starting now to develop their own. It's not going to be easy. I remember it takes a lot of R&Ds. And if they are coming with their own battery shopping stations, they need to make sure that their technology is a bit higher than that of Neo, which won't be easy at all. The chances of them achieving that, it, it, it is very high, right? So yeah, man, the sooner they join, the better. Like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. I'll see you on the next one, man. Share to you, or everyone that, of course, you think they will really appreciate this kind of content because knowing or seeing this kind of move by Mercedes, it also gives us the confidence as the new investor to say that, look, even big premium brands see the moves or the major moves that Neo is making. I'll see you in the next one and God bless you all.